all of a sudden, this finally came in the mail after uh, a couple months uh, about time. This does not really uh, mean too much to me, uh, but a lot of people do these unboxing videos, so I'll do it and also take this opportunity to make a couple of announcements for the channel and some other things I'm working on uh, that are very important that uh, you guys should all know. That looks pretty fancy, actually. Actually, it's not even... I thought these were like metal <laughs> in videos. I've seen with these before, but it's like a picture frame and then a little mirror thing. Thank you, presented to Norse Magic and Beliefs, for passing 100,000 subscribers. All right, enough of that garbage. So I would definitely like to say thank you guys, especially those of you who have followed me since the start. It wasn't that much more than a year ago. The channel just had well, a couple thousand subscribers and in, in a little over a year it grew to more than 100,000. So thank you for everyone. It makes me really proud that people are interested in these things and interested in learning the history and the spirituality, uh, even though I present things in... Uh, pretty boring way <laughs> just uh, try to make it as fun as I can but uh, going over these mundane sources um, is not the most entertaining videos and I'm not the most entertaining person and my editing skills and video producing skills are definitely not that good so just the fact that the channel has made it that big is really impressive it means that you guys basically are that hungry for the knowledge and are that interested in the knowledge and the real history because that's about all I have to offer. But on to some more important things. Um, the reason I started this channel, it has changed. Uh, from what the start, I basically just created the channel and spoke about the subjects that I did is because I was tired of the constant stream of people online just making up a bunch of crap and, and shit about my ancestors' religion, so at least when we get these sources, we do it right. That's why I started the, uh, the channel, okay? It developed into something else, and what I've seen happen is people are getting so, you know, passionate and interested in the real history, and this is a very, very beautiful thing. And I'm so happy about this, because now my goals and the reasons why I make the videos have changed. No longer is it just to spread information, but I can really see the potential in all this. So my main goals with the channel are just to get people interested in their own history, get people interested in the real history of their own people, whether you be Scandinavian, Norse, or whether you be Saxon, or, or Dutch, or German, or no matter where you come from in the world, my goal is to get people interested in their own native beliefs. Because I think when this happens, there is such a love and appreciation that you have for your own culture. When things like this exist, it's almost like a people can never be fully conquered in a way. It sounds crazy, you know, conquering people of today looks a lot different than people getting conquered 1,000 years ago, 2,000 years ago, but the principles are the same. You're trying to make a culture extinct. You, even if it's not like 2,000 years ago where a massive invading army comes in and wipes out the native people of a, a land, there are still forms of, you know, eradicating certain cultures of the world and it's wrong. When we remain interested and remain proud and remain loyal to our native cultures, this just makes it so that no matter what kinds of outside forces come in trying to put you down, whether you be an individual or a group or a neighborhood or a country or a, a family, whatever, if you are proud and have knowledge of your own native culture, it's impossible to remove that. It's impossible to get rid of these old cultures. As you guys have shown just by watching this video, we have a thousand years now of people trying to get rid of Norse culture and trying to make up lies and slander it and try and just destroy the things that were good about it and make it sound worse than it was. But when we have logical people who know better, that makes it so these cultures will survive forever. And this is really my main goal with the channel now. It's to get people who are interested in Norse culture to learn the real ways and 
preserve this long after I'm dead. I'm only one person and I can make these videos for a bit longer, but if we get an army of people just as educated and as interested in the culture as I am, then this will grow and it will turn into something and we can really bring back these lost beautiful ways. This leads me to my next announcement. Um, most of you watching have admiration for these old peoples of the world, these old religions, these old way of life, and if you're like me, like I know a lot of you are, you realize that the world, the modern world, is going in a very bad direction, and you know that we can save ourselves and really develop a beautiful society and a beautiful way of living if we learn from the past, go back to the past, back when humans were healthy and strong and happy and living with nature, living with their spirituality and just being content. I'm not saying that they were all geniuses back then, but they had something very, very valuable to their society that I think we really need today, and that is just being at one with nature, caring about your friends, your family, your people, those around you, and kind of getting back to the old ways, taking the positive things from past cultures and bringing them into the positive things from modern cultures. Take the good things and leave the bad things out. So this is what the next project uh, I am involved in. United Homesteads. This is not my project. I'm just uh, doing a little bit of their marketing. It's a great team of people. They're about to launch. And this is going to be really big and really significant for the future, especially in the next few coming years. It's not just about, as I've spoken on this channel before, it's not just about buying a big chunk of land, moving off grid, and, and being a bunch of peasants living in the woods. Even though I would like that, uh, the reality is that is not possible to do. Humans are meant to live in groups. They depend on each other. This is how we evolved over the ages. It wasn't being lone wolves or lone bears wandering through the woods, okay? It was in tribes, relying on each other, living in close connection to the people we care about so we can help each other, trade, build relationships, and do all these things that enables us still to live with nature and still living in a small enough community so we don't have to be living in cities with you know millions of people who we don't even know we don't even like but living in the small communities with the people we care about and this is in my opinion the best way to live so this is exactly what united homesteads is doing so that's my announcement i want everybody to go check out the website like i said it's it's not mine i just help them out it's a great team of people i'm just helping them out with the marketing i run the tiktok page so you guys can go check that out on tiktok if you like there will be lots of education on there news articles uh, learning capabilities and also like qualifications almost so you can build the skills and then also earn these specific qualifications so everyone else knows that you have those skills those are the values that you provide and that will eventually ideally result in you and getting together with uh, others who have the same values and you share the same needs and you offer different things to bring to the table and then you come together and develop these communities that is basically the background of united homesteads and what they're all about so go check out the website and the tiktok i will be involved in that too i will be a, a regular user of that and um it's going to be very interesting to see uh how that develops and the kinds of communities um, and values Value that we can bring to everybody and uh, make uh, make our lives a better place for the changing world like I said by using past cultures and bringing the positive things in from that with the positive things from modern times so that's about it that's my big announcement again thank you for the 100,000 subscribers uh, lots more coming to the channel also um, some different projects um, that I can't reveal yet but uh, there will be in the next few months so that's all for today we see you next time